now it is freely available on my website what is your website www.annirajan.com okay and since nobody was giving me any server space to understand my work so i just built my own okay and i have put it here now i can show you a simple uh, i have all these four tools i have built up i will show you each one of them so this is a power stagger that is part of speech tagging for konkani and uh, this you have you can enter a data here and it will tell you the tags i see okay that is what the back part what of is it used for uh, when we want to learn some research work yeah we want to know what is that meaning of that grammar part okay so that is i can show you one example yeah. for konkani morphological analysis you take any of these words i have given sample words here yeah take this sample words paste it here it will analyze for you and tell you the grammar part i see so any researcher wants to study or somebody wants to know what is the grammar part then that is possible i have not put a voice set because i don't have that voice clippings okay now i want to know the stemmer stemmer is like go go is the root word of going gone yeah so i have taken this word uh, okay okay hum ambo khata copy paste it here So how is having no root? Yeah. Ambo is having yeah. no root. Yeah. Ani kata is ka. So it is to showing it. Yeah. yeah ka. So the root word is ka. I can enlarge this for you. And then it is showing how many the statistics also. I had totally given three words. Detected three words. Undetected are three words. So this will help a learner again. This is higher level learning. when you have learned to read and write then you are at a certain so you want to learn the grammar part of it because a language depends on a grammar yeah. so you have you can put any of the sentences and see what is it how do you have such a deep interest in language actually i really do not know any language to speak other than english my yeah. home language is malayalam and konkani i have learned here yeah. i have not learned any foreign language yeah. but then i realized that uh, i may not know language but, but you can use your skills i can use my skills to promote these languages and my other good thing was that when i go to kerala i find konkani speakers who know malayalam yeah so they have some tutorials also there they also have some tutorials i've seen on youtube yes 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 they have there is a huge community yes, there yes yes there's a huge community then they are doing 5 lakhs or yeah, something yeah they are doing lot of work but you know this is all malayalam oriented then so i told them they have two schools in kerala who are teaching the okay. same syllabus same syllabus same syllabus of konkani so they said uh, the same textbook we are following now this is in kochi it is in uh, yes kochi ernakulam 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 so they also told me that this in fact one of the sir ramesh uh, payanur i have given him a copy of this of with this. all yeah with all the textbooks and I all and he was uh, he was saying the same thing they are teaching here in our school ah um, because texts are in shortage otherwise they don't have no te, no in konkani they don't have konkani they have in oh, first only, to fourth you only from goa no there are people yeah, yeah. learning correct but the they same. don't have textbooks they have, no they have the same textbooks they take the textbooks yes yes they have oh, yeah. the same textbooks they don't have yeah but so it was useful for them also to listen to this, i see uh, i see uh, the konkani version i see, version I see understood yeah. so these these tools which i have built they are bit of higher level okay. i cannot give it to a first standard or a correct. second correct. standard correct. because they correct. don't know what is a stemmer like yeah. in fourth standard it is more of listening and studying yeah. so that is where these tools i will be incorporating into my original thing once i expand to a few more languages interesting so that is what is my work and uh, once i'm successful with totally konkani whatever i want to build then it's a easy job for me go to a state take their books find a narrator do the narration put up this understood so that is what uh, i would like to intend to do on the for interesting uh, since i found your articles towards konkani and i said this is one aspect which i wanted to put across to you but professor uh, what are the advantages of this system visavi uh, say just youtube See, YouTube is actually not a learning tool. Okay. Are you going to say a first standard student open your YouTube and see this, study this? In YouTube, I cannot put a AI solution. Okay. I cannot say that. Okay, now you have read the chapter Piki Piki Kazule. Now you will say. Yeah. Let us see how much you know correctly. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That is not possible in a, in a YouTube. And YouTube is, to be frank, not a. It's more entertainment oriented. It is. It is like a. You can say a. TV. Uh, you i would say it is like a dumb yard where you dump all your things over there like people are giving interviews people are doing with it's it's yeah. a good platform but it is not an educational platform right
which is not an educational platform. So we should be able to realize what is an educational thing, what is not. And if you are seriously about the language, now this YouTube channel for terminologies in Konkani, many people still don't know. I should have yeah. expected that they should have seen YouTube and learned this. No, no even I, I was not aware of it. Yes. yes. You know, so. so it is like... Yeah, you, know, you cannot... Discoverability is no, not high. No, no, no. But when you are going to a classroom learning, it has to be organized, well managed. Then only the learning will be imparted to the student. We cannot tell the student, okay, you have not understood picky picky because you go and see YouTube. That's not the way. Yeah. Now suppose if a mechanical student does not understand some process, you can say go and see YouTube and learn. Yeah. The student has to be actually, you know, uh, taken to that part right, right. to understand. No. Yeah. So that is my perception. And many people have told me, even when I pitched this for the first time, they told me, you all you can put on YouTube and sit. And I said, sir, I put terminologies in Konkani one year back. Do you know no, 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 I, I'm not arguing against yeah, it. Uh -huh. See, there are different options yes, and each yes. one has its own yes, value. Yes, 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 there yes, is yes. no denying that and you never know what will work and what will yeah. work very well. Huh. And you never know what will catch people's imagination. So we have to try yes. 101 if not 1001 yes, yes. So I felt approaches. that this was something what not there. And no, very interesting. When it I spoke is. to Madash Sheila Jaymant also, uh, she said we need something that way. It is interesting. Yeah. It so is interesting. The only thing is I have developed for them, I have given them four pieces. I just gave it free of cost for them because I wanted, I mean she understood what Proof of concept yes. kind of thing. So I just gave it to them. Uh, and I'm sure it will pick up maybe a bit slowly. Very good. Uh, but, uh, your work has been going for a long time so I'm sure yes, it yes, definitely will pick a, up. Yeah, I've seen your long, papers yes. since many many years hmm. because they are all in open source yes, and we find them there open access yes, and something yes, of that. Yes, so. Thank you. And I was the first one to write a certificate.